637 each Saturday from now on. We're going to spend a little time looking at what's been trending online leading up to the weekend. So here are the top five stories read by you on all of our digital platforms this week. Well, number five, this is great. The hot dog kid. This Biddeford student dressed up as a hot dog in his ID picture on a dare from his parents. And I don't think anyone will catch up to him in the ID costume field anytime soon. Number four, a man gave his family a laugh at his own funeral, playing an audio recording of himself saying, let me out, among other things, as he was buried. Come Friends on. and family say he recorded the video before he died, and he would be overjoyed to see how many smiles and laughs it has cost. Well, number three, a spectrum outage in Portland affected the cable and internet of 3,000 customers. The outage was caused by an uh, excavator damaging a fiber optic line while digging in downtown Portland. Service was restored from most customers by late Tuesday night. Number two, a mass migration of butterflies and dragonflies was caught on radar in Oklahoma. They passed through the state on a north wind behind a cold front earlier in the month. What a spectacle there. And number one, more than 200,000 Mainers losing power after this week's nor'easter. 60 mile per hour winds knocking down trees and power lines causing the outages. CMP and Amera are still working to get power back for thousands. And that is a look at the top five stories for us online this week. You could read more about these stories and a lot more news and weather, of course, on our website and our mobile app.